Good morning, everybody. Welcome to my channel. It's Colleen from Get Art Creations. So today is a journal reveal. Uh, this journal is uh, heading off to its forever home in the next few days. And it's for a very special friend of ours. Um, so yeah, you're going to notice it's obviously for a gentleman and it is a baseball slash music slash scripture themed journal because um, all those things uh, are important and special to him. So it actually, it's a couple of years overdue. It was a, a gift I wanted to make for his 60th and he's past that. However, you know what they say, better late than never. So hopefully he likes it. I had a blast creating it, even though I am so not a baseball fan, but I used a few kits and I will link these shops down below um, because I have never made this themed journal before, I had to really do some, um, you know, retrieving of some themed, baseball themed, um, printable images and whatnot. And I think I pulled it off pretty well. And let's see, um, I have a few charms here. How cute are these? This is a baseball and ba uh, two bats and a ball and a ball glove with a ball. So I do have some charmed, uh, some baseball charmed theme charms. And then a couple of other like men tool type charms, which is kind of funny because he does, he's like my husband, they will both happily admit they're not handyman. And so, but just for fun, I added like a hammer and I, I, I don't remember what other charm I, I uh, added. But anyway, I think he'll get You'll find that a little humorous, perhaps. But anyways, as you can see, um, the, the front cover page pa uh, paper is, I had to do it tall instead of like, I had to do a vertical. Um, it, it was actually supposed to be um, hor horizontal because it's supposed to be a ball field, you can tell. However, I thought it didn't really matter. I wanted the green and some of the effect of what a ball field would re resemble and my stamp. And handmade with love by Colleen. And then I layered some stuff up on the on the front here and um, on the spine. I, you know what? Again, I've I've only made a very few journals for for men. I find them a little more challenging. But um, I just added some cork and some old fashioned buttons. I don't know. Had to put something on the spine, and so I didn't want to do a big frilly, um, lacy dangle. So I decided to go with, with this. So that's that. I'm going to kind of just browse through it with you with some music. No talking. I hope my Wi-Fi is going to cooperate today. It hasn't been cooperating very much lately. But we'll do our best. So I hope you enjoy it. After I show you this video, or this journal, I'm going to show you a quick glimpse of my next giveaway. And uh, yeah, so... Anyways, thanks guys for stopping by. I hope you enjoy it and uh, I'll probably chit chat briefly with you after this is done.
kind of uh, turned out pretty well, I think. <coughs> hopefully, <coughs> excuse me, hopefully he likes it. Okay, <coughs> just one last little business matter. Um, here's my next giveaway. So I got to just taken some, I think I shared these these uh, signatures with you a little bit ago. I got sidetracked with, uh, this is a, another kit by um, Dawn from the Book Vandal Shop. It's her Spring Blossom Kit. And I'll link it down below. Um, so I, what I did, I had the signatures folded and I had a few pages in each one sitting uh, um, um, aside. And then she sent me a different kit and I worked on that one for her instead. This one was just my own. I had my files I'd saved. I think I did a project using this kit before. But I thought, how fun would it be if I do another giveaway? Like I said, in each signature, I've compiled a whole different pile of papers and whatnot. And I didn't sew them in yet. And I thought, I'm gonna, we're going to do a giveaway for all four signatures. So there's quite a few pages in each one. But I also want to encourage the winner to create their own cover, spine, or however one, however you want to do this. Um, uh, I think it would make a beautiful journal and a, probably a three-inch spine, and then you could just load it up with some goodness. I'll send the tool along. And uh, yeah, so it's her Spring Blossom Kit. It is colorful and cheerful and super fun. And I've added a lot of my own little different pages and whatnot. So if anybody's interested in this giveaway, um, I will be back, will be watching my channel. Um, I don't know when I'm going to do this, but it's going to be in the very near future. And I hope that you'll enter and I hope you'll win and make something wonderful with it. Because it's a beautiful kit. It really, really is. So, yeah, just because I, again, always appreciate you, you guys, and um, I do tend to do quite a few giveaways. I did just do one. Um, for those that did win, your winnings are en route, minus one. Um, she never did get back to me with her address, so I'm not sure what I'm going to do with that one yet. But that said, there are two giveaways en route to their recipients, and this one will be the next one. So, that said... Thank you guys for popping by. Thanks for watching this baseball themed video journal. And um, I hope to see you guys soon. Have a really wonderful day and we'll talk again.